Hey, everybody. Welcome. We are doing a super casual pop-up live stream this morning. This, my friends, is what did you call it, honey? My battle wound? Mm -hmm. Mr. Chris Sips TV said, this is my battle wound today. I got a curling iron burn. I've had such bad luck with my curling iron lately, you guys. I, um, I was using this hot tools curling iron and I kept burning my hair, which is why I'm parted on the other side. Totally burned here, totally burned back here. So I've switched completely over to, um, what I can't remember what that curling iron is that you bought me for Christmas a few years ago. It's fancy. Will you go grab it for me? It's in there. Stop the preview. Oh, okay. How do I stop the preview? It doesn't say stop preview anywhere. Can you show me? Sorry guys. We're sitting at my computer today. So this is going to look a little different. Do you see anything that says stop preview? Can everybody see me guys? Um, can you type a comment and let me know if you can hear me talking right now? I just want to make sure we're live. Hi, Rebecca. Hi, Margie. Hi, Karen. Hi, Peggy. Let me know if you can hear me, please, everybody. Hoping that you can. Yeah, Peggy said yes. So we're live. We're good. I don't think it's I don't think it's a pre-roll. It's not, but okay. He's what you're doing, you're should be downstream at the same time. Okay, cool. Will you grab me my curling iron out of the hall bathroom? Anyway, hi guys. Super casual live stream today. As you can tell, I'm basically in my pajamas. Um, but I do want to show you the lipsticks. I want to talk to you about why I'm switching. I don't think I'm not even sure if I'm using this microphone or not, but I'm gonna leave it there because it looks kind of cool, I guess. <laughs> but then we're going to do an unboxing. We're going to unbox um, a regular Ipsy. And thank you, sweetheart. And we're going to unbox a, um, a Paravita bracelet club. And I think that this might just be, let's see, I'm going to try to take a peek. Yeah, this might be the February one that's very Valentine's Day, very cute. And then we're going to do last month's Target Beauty Box, which looks like this. And then we're going to do some um, larger Ipsy Plus, so the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Um, but before we do, let's talk lipstick because I've been um, I've been hearing from a lot of you guys. Hey, Seth, how are you, man? Um, I've been hearing from a lot of people over the years that they want, they like lip sense, but that it's very expensive and they want an alternative. And I joined as a distributor to get the discount. And I ended up over a period of about two years, just not loving the product anymore. And honestly, not really loving the way the company was run. I'm going to be totally frank with you guys. Um, I, you had to spend a certain amount of money to keep your distributorship. I didn't want to sell it. So I wasn't using it. I was just giving some to my mom and using it for myself. And it just was way too much money. I would have to spend two to $300 every time I went on the website and who needs that much lipstick. Also my um, membership lapsed. And the thing that really disappointed me was that I never even knew it was happening. I got one email like six months ago saying, if you don't spend this much by that time, you won't be able to keep your distributorship, but then there was nothing else. Like you would think that they would give you a countdown or something. And I was just, I was super disappointed in that. And I really don't like being negative, but I have to be honest with you guys because I have been such a big proponent of using lip sense for so long and I'm not really using it anymore. Um, it stopped working very well on me. Um, and I was really tired of spending $25 for a gloss, 24, a, I mean, excuse me, $25 for a color, 20 for a gloss. So I still have a ton of it. I use it occasionally, but I've pretty much replaced it with some other products. And I'm going to tell you today what they are. And they are extremely inexpensive compared to, um, to lip sense. And yeah, Seth, I know, right? Totally. And that was another thing people were talking to me about the, the multi-level marketing, um, the person that used to sell the lip sense to me that I loved stopped selling it. And so we, we didn't, I didn't have that connection anymore. And I didn't really have anyone coming out of the woodwork and saying, I want to help you or anything like that. I was really, really disappointed, but yeah, Seth, I totally agree with that. So I'm going to show you guys what my alternatives are. The lighting in here is really not representative of what I'm wearing today, but this is my everyday lip color right here is this Maybelline Superstay 24 hour lip color. I'm going to hold it up for a little while. I know it's covering my face, but it's more important to me that you see the lip color right now. This color is called blush on. It is actually a golden pearly pink and it's absolutely beautiful. I love it. And I'm wearing it now. I wear it every day. I wear it to the gym. I wear it to work. 
unless I'm looking for more of a pop of color. Yeah. Thank you, Rebecca. Um, you guys, this is so in incredibly inexpensive. I'm going to tell you what the prices are right now. Hang on. I just need to Maybelline super stay. I'm just typing it into my, my bar here. Um, if you buy this at, um, Ulta, it is nine 49 and it comes with the gloss. So you put it on, you let it dry just like lip sense. But to me, it's it for me, it's only one coat. Maybe some days it's two coats. And then you put the gloss on top. But the gloss is more like a chapstick. So it's not sticky or gooey. And I'm really happy with it. I have been using this, you guys, for at least two months before I wanted to come on and tell you anything about it. Because I really want to be careful what I recommend, obviously, on this channel. You know, we just recommend the things we use in our daily lives. I'm literally tapping my head with lipstick. Sorry. Um, <laughs> but yeah, Rebecca, it's so great that they come together. I know they are in the same thing. It comes with a gloss. So I've been extremely happy with this color. I want to tell you guys, too, you, you guys have seen my mom. Um, when my mom went to Cabo with me, she tried it and she has totally different coloring. She's a spring and I'm a summer, meaning that I have very pink undertones and my mama has very um, yellow undertones in her skin, I guess you could say. And we wear totally different colors. She rocks this color. We both love this color. So if you're looking for a neutral pearly pink, guys, this is lovely. And you've been seeing me wear this a lot on YouTube as well, okay? So this is awesome. Now, if you want to have some fun and go with a pop of color, this is what I was wearing on the live stream the other day. This is a very vibrant purple. It's violet -y, and it's called, oh dear God, they, you guys, this is the only downside about this product. This is so small. I cannot even see the name. Um, I do not know the color. So let me Google it. Hold on one second, please. I want to say this might be, oh dear, I'm having a hard time finding it. It's color number 85. So let me search it. Maybelline Super Stay 85. And I'll tell you the color, but this is the most gorgeous color. Oh shoot. I can't find it. Um, I want to say it's got the word lilac in it. Um, 85, right? Let's find it. Oh, Sorry for the delay, you guys. I'm just really determined to make sure I give you the right color because I am so in love with this one. Um, shoot. I'm going to find it and I'm going to put it in the chat for you or excuse me, in the description later. Uh, lots of links are in there right now. But um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Rebecca, good idea on the Target coupon. So anyway, gorgeous purpley color. You guys can get these at your local Target store. Or you can get them using the links that I put in the description. Excuse me. I put in, I think I put in an Ulta. I think I put in some Ulta and Target options. Okay, so that's the first brand I'm loving. Again, it's Maybelline Superstay 24-Hour Color. There's another one that I love absolutely just as much. And this is a box. This is CoverGirl Outlast All Day Lip Color. And this is Always Rosy. <clears throat> Here we go. Always Rosy. Now, the difference here is that this comes in a set of two. So you have the lip color and the gloss separately, which actually isn't bad because what I found is that there's more gloss in these. As you can see, you're going to get a nice full gloss. So that's not a downside at all other than you have to keep them together. This is a beautiful, actually quite, um, this is kind of a cool toned pink, this one. Someone asked what color was the pink. Um, Rebecca, was that you? This is my favorite color, and this is blush on, and this has a very pearly look to it. It's got a little bit of gold undertones, as you can see on my, I have it on right now, and I'm super duper happy with it. Um, Isabel said, will these leave lip marks on your cup? Okay, Isabel, it's not as perfect as lip sense in that way, but it's extremely minimal. Most of the time I see a little bit of gloss on the cup and at times I have seen the tiniest hint of color, but it's not like normal lipstick at all. So I want you to know, Isabel, it's kind of, it's the only disappointment I have. And I think I was going to forget to tell you guys that had you not brought it up. So I'm really, really glad that you told me about that because it's, it sometimes does happen. What I've found too is if I'm really careful and I let the base color set before I put the gloss on, it doesn't happen. But you'll have just like a teeny tiny speck of it on the side of your cup, but not a lip mark, 
if that makes sense. It's nothing like um, nothing like regular lipstick. Peggy, it is absolutely not drying. Lip scents, when you put it on, has a very chemically smell and you have to put three coats and it burns your lips at first, especially in winter. This does not have any drying effect. My lips are no longer peeling like they were before. They were peeling um, when I would use lip scents. Now, you guys, I have, I, I want you to, I want to be really clear. I don't have anything against lip scents as an organization. I never, I never got to know them well enough to say that I'm, I, 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 to say anything truly negative. The only thing I can tell you is just my personal experience with it wasn't positive enough to continue with them. And it was just too darn expensive. And I, we live on a budget so that we can afford to travel more. And cosmetics is not something I want to spend $200 every so often on for lipstick. It was just unnecessary for me personally, but nothing against the organization. Um, yes, the cover girl, um, Anita, the cover girl is just as good. It is just as good. You guys, if I missed any questions earlier, please, you you can certainly retype them. Um, I'm, I have plenty of time today. It's no problem at all. Okay, so that's the lipstick that I've been wearing long wear. If you want to try, this is something I've mentioned many times before, but if you want a plumping gloss, this is not a long wearing option. This is Buxom in Kanani. This is a gorgeous Again, a kind of a golden pink color. Super happy with this. I absolutely love this gloss. It's very plumping and it gives you very minty breath. Sometimes at the end of the day, I'll actually put this on right over the top of um, the, um, the Maybelline and it works out great. I mean, I don't, if I'm going to be reapplying gloss throughout the day, I do not put this on as a gloss. I only use the chapstick stuff that it comes with. But at the end of the day, when I want some freshness, I love that. And it's extremely minty. So it makes me feel like I just brush my teeth. It is that minty. I'm a huge fan of these Buxom plumping glosses. And I've linked to Kanani. If you do not like pinks, a beautiful neutral tone for anyone, even you, Seth, I'm joking. Um, <laughs> um, a beautiful neutral is Dolly. Buxom and Dolly. It's gorgeous. Okay. Hi, Linda. Welcome. Okay, so let's unbox, guys. We got through the whole lipstick thing. And for those of you who are here earlier and I was talking about my curling iron, I wanted to let you know that this is the T3 curling iron that I use. Um, it's really high quality and nice. The barrels are um, removable and you can put different barrels on. It just comes right off like that. And I'll get you guys a link for the T3 as well. I did not put a link in the description yet, so I'll get a link for you afterwards and I'll have it in the description when we're done. But yeah, you can, you can get adjustable barrels. I think this might be like a, uh, one and a half maybe, but it's really good and it doesn't damage your hair. Just be very careful not to turn that curling iron all the way up. You don't want to turn it all the way up. And this is my curling iron burn. For those of you who have just joined, my husband's calling this my battle wound. I barely tapped my skin with my curling iron the other day and boom, that's what happened. All right. So good to see everybody. Shirley said the best lipstick and glo um, gloss combo you've ever tried is Tarte. Yummy scent available at Ulta. Shirley, can you please tell me more? Hi, babe. It's going great. Thank you. Um, Shirley, is it a long wearing product? Please, can you tell me the name of it? I really want to hear about this. Um, I'm excited. I'm, I'm really into long wearing lipsticks. Okay, let's unbox our Pura Vita. This, I believe, was from February, guys. This is a month behind. It's really pretty. I peeked at it because I had to. But this is it. It looks very Valentine's Day. I'm going to hold it up for you guys. This is a um, Pura Vita bracelet stack. It is a monthly subscription for $15. You get three bracelets. So I'll separate the bracelets out a little bit better so we can see each one of them. Um, but I've got an affiliate link in the description, but you can see all three of the bracelets here. You can wear them together or you can mix and match. The bracelet on the top is a pretty little heart. The one in the center is a regular classic bracelet. And the one on the bottom is a beautiful beaded bracelet. These are so cute. So they did this kind of as an ode to Valentine's day. Okay. Shirley, can you tell me what it's called? Hi, Cindy. I'm happy to see you too. Oh, that's so awesome, Linda. I'm so glad you shared your bracelets. That's a really good idea. They make great gifts. Anyway, this is one of my favorite things. I, I have never canceled my subscription 
to Pura Vita bracelets. I love the monthly bracelet club. I do not subscribe to the jewelry club because I don't know if I would like it as much, but um, yeah, kind of fun. So I'm going to go back and unbox one of my Ipsies now. I have no idea which one this is. You guys, I'm really sorry that I haven't been as regular with you with unboxings. Life has been so busy and I, I also have been trying to buy a few less products because I have a surplus of them and I don't want to spend as much money. So please forgive me. Okay, this is so pretty. I have a feeling this was probably February's beautiful little velvety plush bag. It feels just as beautiful as it looks. It's so cute and so velvety. I love it. So let's see what is inside this gorgeous little bag. This is the, I think it's $12 a month now, Ipsy Glam Bag subscription. I have a referral link in there. This one says, feel the love. So yeah, I think this must have been the February one. And we'll see what we have inside the bag. You get five items for a big, I think it's 12 bucks. And the first item in here is a little box of Murad Renewing Eye Cream. How cute is that? This is so cruise worthy, you guys. I'm really impressed. Hi, Jim. I'm so glad that you're here. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, cool. Thank you, Deborah, for letting me know about that tip with the Revlon. That's awesome. Yes, Seth, they can totally add up and be expensive. Holy cow, this is tiny, you guys. Look at this itty bitty renewing eye cream. It's so small. I mean, we're talking, you guys, this is 0.14 ounces. This must be really good stuff if they think that they can call that one item. However, Murad is an incredible brand, and this would be excellent on a cruise because you will come home with absolutely zero waste. Okay, I do like it. I do like it. Don't get me wrong. They are tiny. The items in this bag are pretty tiny. Okay, next up is an It Cosmetics Primer Oil-Free Makeup Gripping Base. Love this. Very It Cosmetics is an excellent brand, and I'm super happy that I got this. Super cruise-worthy. That is two for two that I'm extremely happy with. Next one is an Avate Water Flash Coconut Cream, hydration boosting, very teeny tiny. I can't even tell you how many ounces it is because I can't read the writing on it. It's too small, but this is cute. Let's um, smell this and see what it's like. Oh, it's sealed. I'm not going to open it because I want to save it for a cruise, but that's cute. I like it. Okay, next product in this little Ipsy guy, and I think this is February, is a four-in-one Love Your Selfie long-wearing foundation and concealer. I like it, also sealed, so I'm not going to open it to see if the color will work for me. I'm extremely picky about foundations. Here we go. Um, because my skin tone is so pink, um, it's difficult for me to find things I like, but we'll all give anything a try. Ooh, you guys, this is from the brand Doucet, and this is a bombastic lash volumizing mascara. I'll show you the wand real quick. Ooh, it's goopy. Ooh, gross. Kind of goopy on the end there. Ooh. Um, anyway, I'll give that a try too. Although I almost, for my mascaras, I almost exclusively use Thrive Cosmetics um, mascara lash extensions. It makes your lashes look so beautiful and so long. I love it. Okay, we're doing great here. We got through the first two. Now we're going to do, let's take a break and do a Target Beauty Box. This is last month's Target Beauty Box. It is still available on the site. Um, I want to tell you which one this is so that you know. Um, da dum da dum da dum. Which one is this? I want to say this is like the. Let me look it up really quick. It's worth it. It's worth it. I promise. I do have a link in the description already for this one. Um, and it's super awesome. It's called. It's called the Clean Up Your Beauty Routine box, and the focus of this particular box is from is to be ingredient conscious formulas and recyclable packaging. And this has nine revitalizing beauty items. I'm very excited. Oh yeah. I love T. Canley. Um, Seth, I haven't been talking about it as much on the channel because I didn't, I, I was finding that nobody was really buying it. I think it's because we have a lot of women who follow us, but I, my husband still uses the samples he has. He has a ton. Everly said, what is your favorite subscription box? Okay. Um, Everly for beauty. I like I really like Ipsy. I've been very happy with it. I don't try a lot of different ones because I don't want to spend a whole lot of extra money. I do really love Target Beauty Box for travel sizes. And I love my um, my Pura Vita Bracelet Club for um, jewelry. I think it's great. Um, Gina Bird said, I'm also very pink. What is your favorite foundation brand? Okay, you're going to laugh at me. But I wear 
a cheap drugstore brand that I'm super happy with. And it is, um, I'm trying to remember. It's the, my shade is C4 and I need to find it for you. It's, I'm getting, get you a link at Target. I'm trying to remember if it's cover girl. I'll, I'll send you a link later, but it's, um, I, I'm, I'm just blanking out right now. Actually, I have, I have access to it. Let me find it for you. Da, 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 da. Bear with me, guys. Multitask in here. Let's see all my links. Here we go. I'm just scrolling. Just a scrolling, just a scrolling. Oh, my goodness sakes. Actually, it's not in there. I'll get you a link a little bit later. Um, I wish my husband was close by because I'd have him go get it for me, but he has stepped out of the room. Um, Everly, I haven't opened my Sips by yet, but I'm going to check it out. Yeah, Susie Q, I know I was getting a little bit too much done. Um, Isabel, I tried a lash lift and I did, it did not work for me. It made my lashes when I put mascara on, they would get all clumpy. And I was so sad because I was really, I had done a good job of regrowing my lashes after I got my extensions removed and it just didn't work out super great anyway. Okay. I'll find you that foundation and I'll get my foundation into the description so you can see it. It's super inexpensive and great. Okay. Let's do the target beauty box now. And again, this one is called the clean up your beauty routine. This is last month's box, but it's still available to you all. And here is the card that you get with it. You always get a coupon, but the coupons expire extremely fast. This one already expired on February 2nd, so I can't use it, but you get $3 off a $15 beauty purchase. And this is what the box looks like. I think, Seth, you're going to like this one. And, Seth, I'm going to show this product for you because look, bud, look what we got. We've got a Native Deodorant Mini. Seth is a Native Deodorant fan, right, Seth? Isn't it Native that you use? Um, this is really great for travel, though, you guys. This is a charcoal. These are aluminum and paraben-free, and it gets great, great reviews. Um, charcoal is actually the scent of this one, I guess. It smells really fresh and wonderful. I don't know why they have a charcoal scent. I think that's kind of interesting. But I can say that this looks like it doesn't have the grainy, um, abrasive consistency that some of the native deodorants have. I know my coconut one does. I know. Aw, thank you, Jim. You're such a sweetheart. Shirley said, try Ulta, Ulta's Demi Matte SPF 20 Foundation Cool Tan. It comes in a tube. Oh, I love you, Shirley. Shirley, are you my new beauty expert today? Ooh, this is fun. I'm getting all kinds of tips. I like it. Okay, guys, this is another awesome sample. Look what this is. Do you see? This is a Love Home and Planet laundry detergent sample. Now, there's a big old coupon on the front of it, so you can't see the packaging. Um, but if I can tear the coupon off, I will reveal the packaging. There it is. Love Home and Planet laundry detergent in la with lavender and argon oil. You guys, how cute is this? It's pretty big too. This is eight ounces. I would imagine you probably get about, um, how many? Oh my word. You guys, you get 10 loads out of the sample. Isn't that cool? Peggy Fab Fit Fun is an awesome subscription box. Um, Peggy, the, uh, there's uh, the last couple of videos on our channel, you'll see we did a FabFitFun unboxing, and you can see all about it there. They're wonderful. They're quarterly subscription boxes, and I love them. Okay, let's see what's next. I want to just go ahead and pop in and see how everybody's doing. Okay, next up, we have a Burt's Bees Purely White Toothpaste. How cute is that? This is really great box. This is a fluoride-free toothpaste in case any of you are interested in that, but it's whitening. And it's peppermint flavored. How cool. Yes, love it. Okay, next up we have a Lumine Nordic Sea Pure Glow Cleansing Balm. Oh, I love trying new cleansers. And I am thrilled about this. I'm trying to get the light off of it for you all. There we go. That is so cute. That is so cruise worthy. Some cotton pads, premium cotton pads. Perfect to pop in your cruise bag. I love it. You guys are so funny. And one of my favorite products. Look at this. It's a coconut, a Palmer's Coconut Formula. Coconut oil body lotion. I take these on vacations all the time. Wonderful to hydrate your legs after a day in the sun or your body. Very happy with that. A teeny tiny Nordic Sea Oil cocktail sample packet in this one. Very cool. I love it. Um, and then next we have a, I don't know what this brand is. I've never heard of it before. Uni Travel Shower Sheet Body Wipe. 
I don't understand what this is for. So I guess this is in case you can't get to a shower. It's like a body wipe. That's neat. And look how cute this is. A little teeny tiny Myers clean day hand soap. It's a sample. I'm not sure when you'd bust this out. Like, oh, I need some hand soap. But you know what? This could actually be a smart thing to keep in your travel bag. If you're on a cruise or something and you walk into a bathroom and there is no soap, this is actually pretty cool. All right. Everly said, what lipstick do you wear on the dress up nights on a cruise? Everly, I usually just wear whatever lipstick I normally wear. I have worn some really gorgeous lip sense colors in the past, like a bright red. Go back to our channel and watch some of my get ready with me videos. And you'll see how we do for formal nights. We actually do full get ready with me videos right here on this channel where we do completely bare face to made up and hair. So just um, go to videos on the tab and type in get ready with me and you can see those. You're going to love them. They're really fun. Cool. Thank you, Rebecca, for that. Yeah, Jim, you like the Palmer's products too. I know. And a lot of us mamas, we encountered um, those products when we were pregnant because Palmer's makes that cocoa butter for mama's bellies, right? So yeah, cool. Hi, Lauren. Lauren is here. Lauren and Rebecca, you're here. I'm so glad to see you. Ooh, yes, Isabel. Palmer's facial oil is your ride or die. I totally hear you. Okay, guys, we have a few more Ipsy boxes. This, I believe, is an Ipsy um, Plus membership. Now, Ipsy Plus is the more expensive membership. I want to say it's $24, $25 a month, and you get more full-size items. To be honest, you guys, this is actually not a monthly, this is not a Glam Bag Plus. This is um, an add-on sale that they did, and I bought a bunch of stuff. So I, I'm so sorry that I got confused there. But these are just some items that I purchased from Ipsy's sale. They are not part of a Glam Bag. There's some bath bombs, an r and Co. Acid Wash Apple Cider Vinegar Cleansing Rinse. It's six ounces, so I couldn't take it in my TSA bag. And then a couple of um, shampoo and conditioners. So again, watch for sales on Ipsy. I just remembered that I left that out because I had not shown it to you guys. So I hadn't started using it yet. Hi, Ginger. Glad you made it. I want to see if any questions have come in yet. Okay. Thanks for being here. You guys are so sweet to join me this, this crazy last minute pop-up little live stream. I know that we didn't plan it very far in advance, but I was feeling it today. I came up from the gym and I told my husband, I'm like, dude, we, we have got all this fun stuff to share. And I've been really wanting to talk about my long wearing lipstick situation. So we just popped in. Hope you don't mind. Hi, Moonsta. Okay. So I think you guys, I'm pretty sure that this is a glam bag plus, um, you can see that the box is really big and it also comes with a bag. I think they've started adding. Can someone clarify with me for me in the chat? If you're an Ipster and you do Glam Bag Plus, have they started including the bag again? Because this one has a bag and I'm thinking that it must be the plus with a bag because some of this stuff is really large. Although it just really doesn't look like a plus bag. I, I'm so sorry, I haven't, um, I've had these on hand for a little while. This is the, my January item and I'm just not sure if this was a plus or a regular. The more I think about it, the more I think this might have been a regular one. So anyway, yeah. Okay, so this is January's bag and I'm going to go over my items with you. The first item in the January bag is the Perlice. This is the Blue Lotus 4-in-1 I Adore Serum. This is a $58 value. Wow, that's expensive. OMG. Wow. Hi, Susie Q. I know. Cute bag, huh, Isabel? Okay. The next item here today is the Hanalei Lip Treatment in Clear. I think this is a cult favorite, you guys, because this Hanalei Lip Treatment, very Hawaii-centric and has Hawaiian botanicals like rare kukui nut, aloe, and agave. Here it is. This is going to be good stuff. I've got one Hanalei item in my bathroom, and I absolutely love it. Yeah, I think so, Linda. I think you're right. Thank you for that. Let's give this a smell. Oh, my goodness. Okay, this is pure Hawaii, guys. This is amazing. Oh, Seth, you would love this stuff. Yes, love it. And this is from Hanalei Company. Loving this. Okay, the next item here today is the Nature's Cartel Lipstick in 90s Nostalgia. I'm 90% sure I will not be able to wear this color. It's probably way too dark brown for me, but let's look at it together and see. 
Um, usually with lipsticks like this, I just take them to work and give them to my work friends quickly. But yeah, I don't know. I mean, it looks a little more nude than I expected. I might give it a try, but I tend to wear more pinks. So you never know, maybe with the right outfit, but I really find that I need more of a pink tone in my lipsticks. Okay, that's a cool item though, a pretty full-size lipstick. I am not complaining about that. Ooh, and you guys, look at this beautiful eyeliner. This is a, uh-oh, where is it? I think I got the wrong item in my box. It says that I'm supposed to have an eyeliner and instead I have a concealer. There is no eyeliner in this box. So yeah, they sent me the wrong item, how funny. Okay, well, we're gonna look at this Morph Fluidity Full Coverage Concealer. I guess that's what I got. Let's check it out. Ooh, I love getting new concealers, especially if they come in a tube. Okay, so it is the plus, Jennifer, is it? Yes, you are a tropical kind of guy, Seth. I know you are. Oh, Isabel, you're going to Hawaii in November. So awesome. Oh my gosh, you're going to love it. Oh, this is nice, you guys. Look at this concealer, full coverage. Let's take a peek. All right, I'm going to put a little bit on my hand. Let's try it together. Okay. How does it look? Um, I'm going to rub it in just a bit and give you guys another look. Okay. I would say it's pretty full coverage. So I am having a hard time getting the focus there. Um, but it's definitely the right shade for me, so I'm very pleased with that. Super awesome. Now, a couple of things you need to know about um, Ipsy is that you they do this really cool thing where you can add products on for really cheap every month um, to your bag. And so I added on a Thrive Cosmetics Liquid um, Lash Extensions Mascara. This is my go-to mascara that I use every day. So when I saw that I could get it for inexpensive, I went ahead and got it. I also added on a Gold Fadden MD Doctor Scrub. Here we go. So this is another, it's just a great brand, and I think I added that on. I'm sorry that I'm not keeping good track of what's what, you guys, but um, I need to unbox more often. But the point is, that is on the floor. Um, <laughs> the point is, we got here today, and we got to hang out together and check it all out. Yeah, Seth, what, um, uh, Isabel, Seth wants to know what islands you're going to. You have to let him know. Ah, oh, cool. Moonsta comes in peace. I love it. Okay. Everly said, what is my favorite item I've ever gotten from a subscription box? Um, I think probably it would have to be that, um, Thrive Cosmetics mascara I first got in a beauty box. And it's one of the things I think that I, that's how I fell in love with it. What else? Oh, that's also how I fell in love with Buxom. I got a little a Buxom gloss sample and that's how I totally was introduced to that. I'm trying to think of other items. I've got some really incredible cleansers before, and I think I got a lip and eye cream that I still use that is so expensive to buy normally, and I, I've been using it for like two and a half years. Let me see if I can find that for you. What's it called? Um, let me see. Lip and eye treatment. I think it might be. I don't think it's First Aid Beauty, but it's some really high-quality brand that I have been um, – been using this product for so long. Oh, I'll have to find it for you later. Let's see. Maybe it's this one. Um, but yeah, a lot of great cleansers. Definitely the Thrive Cosmetics, probably maybe my top one. All right. Isabel, you're sad because it's not a cruise. I know. Yeah, Isabel, Seth is totally a Hawaii expert. So if you need any help, definitely let him know. He's there for you. Okay, you guys, this was super great. Um, I really appreciate you all being here. I'm sorry that I'm not dressed up today. My hair is all ratty. I barely have any makeup on, but I love that about this channel is that we just come and hang out casually. Of course, we can do that at Cruise Tips TV too, but this is just a special a special place for me. So thank you for being here. Um, we're doing March Muster right now on our regular channel, which means that we're live three times a week, every Monday, Thursday, and Friday at youtube.com forward slash Cruise Tips TV, 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern. And we're doing a lot of Q&A. We've been talking a lot about coronavirus lately. It's just on everyone's minds. So anyway, thank you all so much for being here. I just want to thank you all again for all the awesome comments and the tips. Um, for those of you who are new here and or for those of you who have shared tips with me today, literally almost everything I've ever learned in the last three years about makeup and beauty has come from this community. So thank you so much. And Cindy, thank you very much. Yes, we all have an at-home look. And I'm, I just, we don't need to all get dressed up for each other. In fact, someday 
Why don't we all have a makeup free party and we'll all go live without makeup, completely without makeup. And we'll all agree to show up without makeup. Does that sound fun? Let's try it. Thank you, Karen. We love you too. And Isabel, thank you so much for your support. Seth and Jim and all the other boys in the house. I love you guys. You're so precious. Thank you for coming and hanging out with the ladies. We absolutely adore you. And we all respect you boys so much for being here for all the beauty stuff. Love you guys. Until next time, get in gear and get cruising. Bye-bye.